turtle is on. The flame inside me yearns to be let free. Let the the I think the you did Are those rocks and skin? Flying free! Why can't they just sit still? See him. Can you take care of them? No sooner said than done. No armor. Stop me. Remind me to stay on your good side. The enemy wields hearts too. We'll soon see about that. Now you see what I can do. Raging storm. You picked the wrong fight. Lightning orb. Strike. Go for the crack. It'll move now. Storm. Don't leave. In an instant. Impact claw. We work well together. Like a finely timed wall. Blazer spear. Pierce evil. Catapult. Do it. Win well. Light burst four! Radiant Genesis! I can feel my precision improving. I found some equipment. Let me take a look at it. Some power you wield. You're the one who did the heavy lifting. You can make plants grow instantly? <gasps> what if we use this for fruits and vegetables? I'd rather not be our party's fertilizer. Thank you very much. Starting to sting, and my throat feels super parched. Here, have some water. Just make sure you don't drink too much. Thanks. You want some too, Shion? Oh, wait. I bet you're hungry more than anything, aren't you? I'm fine, thank you very much.
Can you take it? Here I come! Does hurt? Seismic rupture! Elusive deity! You have to aim for the secondary on your back! Stardust! Go for the weak point! Now! Bizarro! All Bastion their defenses! Glad you had... Go for it! Prepare to crumble! Lightning! Seismic rupture! Glacial spear! Pierce the evil! Heave the enemy's arch! Charge like that could easily be here! Just as well, I'm here to stop it! Your Driven in. It's over. Stop. Stop. Keep striving. You can ease off yourself. Thought calls the kettle black. Good advice for all of us. will hold itself together, right? Most definitely. Though I won't make any promises. Which one is it? Retreat Earth if you storm. know what's good for you! None shall escape Try my judgment! Pressure. Light You're mine! It's, it's a duel of the arts! Do it! Illuminate the dark! Come forth, holy quiver! We've got flyers! I've got them! Here I got a marksman! An all yours! Seismic rupture! Can make it over! Start us! Lightning orb! Raging storm! Take this! It's over! Lightning orb! Raging orb! As impressive as always. Ah, Do it! Here I hope that was no, I I mean you're even better than ever. Go for it! Prepare to crumble! Resonate with the earth! Uh, you you you're mine! You're mine! On your knees! You're finished! I'm all stuck up! Full of blade! The flame inside me! Do you're it! To be let free! Don't leave! In an instant! Impact, Impact cross! cross. Didn't even break a sweat. Don't 
I'll face you. We turn the tables on her. There are still more left. Right. No time to hold back. Resonate with the earth. Freezing storm. Take this. On your own. Now. Air pressure. Dragon swarm. Lightning lord. Here I come. Lightning lord. Freezing storm. Dragon swarm. We did it. As impressive as always. Holy fire. I swear to No, I'm ready. I mean, you're even better than ever. This ends now! Consider yourself finished! With your flames and my technique? We're stronger together than we are apart. Airborne scoundrels! Sounds like a job for your own coming in after me! I'm coming very well! I'm not scared! I'm totally fine! Those are impressive skills! They took a lifetime to master! You know, I'll have to keep training! Try hard! Not a chance! I'm not done! Dragon swarm! Okay, here I go! No art of being interrupted! Here I come! Here it Luna Rondo! I'm ready! Take it! Man, Jolene! Like this one's got your name on it! Ashes to ashes! A merry distraction! Not There's yet. still more to go! Now! Well, looky here! Yeah, then I'll provide assistance however I can. As impressive as always. Here I hope there is a good. No, I I mean you're even better than ever. Seems about right to me. Callus. Calcified. Calaglia. What kind of poem is that? A sparse one. to small fry. It's crazy to see rocks melt before our eyes. Watch where you're going, everyone. If you fall, there will be nothing left of you. 
Exactly. So don't try anything funny. Especially you, Law. No pushing anyone, not even as a joke. I didn't know you had that sort of trick up your sleeve, Dorling. I would have figured rocks and plants would be... ...be too different for you to handle both. Took more energy than I expected. Probably that monster Nath warned us about, if I had to guess. Do you think this might have been where one of those lights that shot out of the wedge landed? But why this location? If the purpose of the wedge is to harvest Dana's astral energy... We can figure that out later. If that thing gets into town, it's going to cause chaos. We need to take it down and move on. Let's go! This 
one's tough, but we have no choice. Let me know if you need healing. Here it comes! Focus! On your toes, everyone! Suddenly turning tail doesn't seem so ridiculous. Why? Are you scared? Me? <laughs> Are you? Do you even have to ask? Of course I'm scared! Focus up before we become that thing's lunch! It's summoning Zoogles? Take care of them while keeping an eye on it! This one keeps them charging us! That's what my shield's for! Get behind me! Got it! I'll leave it to you! Azure Storm! Ready and ready! Sleep now! 
surrender. We won't retreat. Not yet. Whatever you do, just please stay safe. Sorry. I didn't want to put you out. What are friends for if we can't depend on one another? I'll handle it. You're right. Just watch and learn. That's enough! Go back down! Everyone okay? Yeah, I think so. That thing scared the pants off me. It felt like it had a different aura than other Zoogles, didn't it? Yeah. It wasn't like the one that Almadria sicked on us either. Its elemental astral energy variance was out of this world. It was like fighting a lord. I guess it's safe to assume that if it came out of the Wedge, it must have played some part in helping harvest astral energy. But what? Perhaps a living spirit vessel? It's plausible, given the location. Or it may be part of a new force dispatched to regain control of Dana. If we assume that monster was one of the four beams of light, we must have prevented something from taking place here. I'd like to think so, knowing how much grief it gave us. But at least with that out of the way, we can keep moving forward now. Let's go. Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood.
Hey, is that it over there? <sighs> hey, look! We've got way more animals! I never imagined Law would have a knack for husbandry. <laughs> Makes sense since they're on the same... Did you remember something? No, but... I have seen that starship before. This is it. This is the ship I traveled in when I escaped from Lenigus. Three centuries later, and it's no worse for wear. I'll take a look at the internals. Damn! I'm amazed it still works at all after all this time. The past meets the present. I really am from a different time and place. Yeah. But you've got us now, Alfin. Not only that, but you've helped out so many people, too. Law's right. Rinwell, too. You're one of us now. No more carrying the weight of history on your shoulders. You're a part of this world. Right. Thanks, you guys. How's it look? It should fly. All internal systems seem to be operating. However, considering how long it's remained inactive, I suspect it will take some time before it's ready for takeoff. How much time are we talking here? Starship mechanics are not what I'd call my forte, so I'd rather not hazard a guess. So we've just got to sit around here and wait? I'm terrible at waiting. That's because you're a child. Oh, but how about we use this time to prepare and gather supplies for the trip? Good idea. Who knows when we'll be back from Lenigus once we leave. We should prepare ourselves for every possible scenario before we go. Let's try not to stay away too long. I'd hate for anything to happen to the place while we're gone. Either we race ahead, or we take due precaution to ensure we have no regrets. I shall leave it up to you as to how we proceed, Alfin. Works for me. It's funny, isn't it? What is? All this. When we first started this thing, did you ever imagine we'd be going to Lenigus? After all, this is the sort of thing I was rebelling against when I ran away from home, right? I'm sure Zephyr would be proud if he knew what his son was doing right now. And a little shocked, too. We're defying the order of things that have persisted for 300 years. <laughs> Deep down, I knew our journey would lead to confronting Lenigus. Yeah, you may be, but you're a Renan. The rest of us can barely even picture what it means to leave Dana. No offense to Xion and Dohalim, but it's worth remembering we're heading into enemy territory. No offense taken, and this is no picnic for me either. Remember, our aim is to ensure that both Lenigus and the Renan homeworld leave Dana alone for good. I don't think we'll be able to avoid a fight. Is there no way we can talk them into leaving us alone? 
The people of Lenigus? Sure. I mean, we found a way to make it work with Xion and Dohalim, right? And it's not just us. If places like Menencia can do it, then why can't we- Because there are still many of my kind who believe it was right and natural that Rena reigns over Dana. There are those on Lenigus who have never stepped foot on Dana. I doubt whether they'd even listen to Danans. Look, none of us want to fight. But these are the same people who fired that wedge down on Dana. What happens next is on them. Right. We're not going to sit back and wait for them to oppress us again. Right. Don't forget, there's also a good chance the Red Woman is somewhere on Lenigus. And wherever she is, we should find the Renesalma, too. That's right. If we can take it back, then Xion can finally get rid of her thorns. <sighs> Xion? Huh? Uh, yeah. Where'd Xion go? How could she just go off on her own? Xion. Xion! <laughs> Thorns? But why? <laughs> you okay? Just now, I looked like you used your maiden powers to suppress your thorns. You can really do that? <laughs> Stay out of my way. Wait a second. Are you planning to go alone? Shut up! Why would you do this?! I told you to shut up! <sighs> I won't let you. I mean it. I refuse to let you. I won't tell you again. Move or I'll shoot. If that's the case... Then go ahead and shoot me! Do you remember back when I was stabbed? By Volron? Yeah. I thought for sure that he had killed you back there. That wasn't the first time. Huh? The first time was when I was only a child. After that, no matter how often, I just couldn't die. Couldn't die? So you're immortal? How's that even... <clears throat> I believe you, Xion. But tell me how... How is something like that possible? My thorns. They're me, but at the same time, not. 
They're part of me. I have no idea why, but my thorns will never let me die. At least not before I'm meant to. You can't die before your death? When my thorns free themselves, it will be my death. <laughs> I've seen it. A darkness that swallows up everything until nothing remains. It's a vision of oblivion I can't escape. I want to believe it's all just a bad dream. But no matter what I tell myself, I... I know it's not. Yeah, but you... Wait, the whole reason you... you needed the Renesalma was to get rid of your thorns, right? If I burn away what's inside, then what will happen to the rest of me? <laughs> right. Either way you look at it, I'm going to die. But if I am going to die, I figure I can at least take my thorns out with me. That's what I've been after this whole time. That's why you turned your back on your fellow Renans and chose to fight with us, isn't it? And while we've all been fighting to keep on living, you have been with us fighting desperately to die. That was the plan? But then I met all of you, and I... Before I knew it, I didn't want to die anymore. Shion, don't lose hope yet. We'll find a way to save you. There's still time to... It's pointless. Why? Because the darkness won't just consume me. The truth is, it will consume all of existence as well. It was only a suspicion at first, but ever since the Red Woman triggered my maiden powers, I've been more certain than ever before. It was then that I finally came to realize my powers were holding my thorns in check the entire time. But they don't anymore. Not since Lenicus, when the Wedge fell. Every day, I feel the thorn's power growing stronger inside of me. Pretty soon, I won't be able to hold them back anymore. And when that happens... They will consume all existence. <sighs> and that's why you wanted to leave by yourself. You planned to find the Renis Alma on your own and sacrifice yourself to stop the thorns. But that's... Too much! It's way too much! When this all began, I didn't care what happened to me or anyone else. And what happened to the Renans or the Danans didn't matter to me at all. I know I have to die. But I don't want to. Not now that I have this. I wish we had never met! Then I wouldn't have to feel this way! Sion! Elfin? Uh. Oh, living for the sake of dying is no better than being a slave! How can you endure this? Elfin! It's not fair. I don't care what anybody says. I won't let it happen! We can fight this! Fight until the end together. Isn't that what you said to me before? Even if it should mean that it'll be the end of everything else, too? Xion, what do you want? It's your decision, ultimately. 
But if you decide not to fight fate, I will. Even if I have to do it alone. No. You won't be alone. I'll fight as well. Count me in as well. I want to be a force for good, not hate. And me too. I meant it with all of my heart when I told you before. Neither of you are alone in this at all. You guys... And I, for one, don't believe this venture is without hope. Huh? Shion is the descendant of a maiden from 300 years ago. Given the circumstances, it seems very likely that those events have some connection to her thorns. The true nature of which, I imagine we will discover as we make our way to Lenegas and uncover the truth of what's unfolding here. I take it you mean we might find a way to get rid of her thorns and she'll live? It's certainly possible. Though I suspect the nature of the Sovereign is connected somehow. So be it. I've already lost everything I had once. And I won't let it happen again. Shion. No matter what happens from now on, we're right here with you. All of us are. You are not alone. You guys, you're all so stubborn. For right now, and a little while longer, I just want to hold on to this dream. And most of all, more than anything else, I want to be with all of you! So let's go. Onto Lenicus. <laughs>